I spent the last 12 hours trying to find a solution for this problem that I'm about to show you. And you're probably also having this problem. And that is the reason why you're watching this video. So I'm going to show this error to you first to make sure that we, we have the same error. I'm going to create a new Unity project using an LTS. I do not know for what reason this has opened, but I'm going to create a project inside of my Unity Hub directory, a uh, Unity Projects directory, I'm sorry. And I'm going to call this test project. And I'm going to use 2D core. So I'm just, I just want to show this error to you to make sure that you these we are having the same problem if you're not then there's no use there you should not really use this fix you can use some other fix okay so the error is this you will see some blank some blank errors in the console so you can hit ignore and when you hit ignore, this is what you'll see, blank errors. What you're going to do is to explain how, how you can detect whether we have the same error or not, or you can see whether we have the same error or not, is if you go down here somewhere, you will find that there is going to be a compile error somewhere. And this was in the editor log, by the way. I'll show it to you again how I opened this. And there is the error. This is, couldn't find a valid ICU package installed in system. Set the configuration flag system.globalization.invariant to true. Okay, so this is the error. If you have opened the editor log over here and you find a, a line that reads like this, we have the same error. To fix this, you simply need one package from the Arch user repository. Now, if you're using uh, Debian or any other Linux uh, distro, you probably have this as well. But mine is, I believe it's called ICU68, ICU68. And for me, it's binary. So it's for me, it's the binary version of ICU68. And I'm just going to install this and the error will be gone please note that uh, if you're using debian ubuntu or any other linux distribution the package name might be different so for me it's this because i'm using arch linux okay so now i'm going to start the project again now i'm going to start the project again and you will see that the error will be gone so this is one error now i have to fix another which is which is in Unity 2021.3.0, but I'll cover this in a later video. There is an error in, in that version of Unity as well. This is for Unity 2020.3 and later versions. So there you go. The error is gone. No blank errors in the console.